Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick information video to keep you posted and in the loop um, if you are using the different Google products and services. Now, recently Google has updated its privacy policy to say basically that they are now going to use information users post online to train their AI models. So that information is your information and my information, just to kind of cut to the chase of this whole story. Now, prior to this recent privacy policy change, which Google did update um, on the 1st of July. So this privacy policy is effective, as we can see, July 1st, 2023. So prior to this um, privacy policy change, Google had mentioned in its previous uh, privacy policy that it used public data to train language models. Now, just in case um, you were unaware, a language model, as an example, is Google Translate. And an AI model, as an example, is Google BARD. So that's the difference. BARD, AI model, Google Translate, language model. Now, moving on. Um, in this recent update to their privacy policy, Google has said, and I'm quoting, for example, we use publicly available information to help train Google's AI models and build products and features like Google Translate, BARD, and cloud AI capabilities, quote, unquote. So that's basically the long and short um, of this updated privacy policy dated the 1st of July. Now, as we can see from that statement, Google now uses the terminology AI models instead of language models in this updated policy, which means by basically, as mentioned previously, the privacy policy mentioned um, language models um, like Google Translate. And as we can see now that this is no longer the case because Google now mentions products like BARD and cloud AI capabilities that will be developed using artificial intelligence. Now, according to the EU, they have already had issues with Google Bard, as many of you may know. And the reason for this is because, uh, just to give you a brief overview in case you missed uh, this previously regarding uh, Google Bard and the EU. According to the EU data protection rules, companies need to take consent from users before collecting and using their personal data. And as we can see with Google Bard now as an AI model, that is not the case according to this latest statement that's been updated recently on the 1st of July by Google. So obviously um, this is going to cause a lot of debate. And um, obviously I will keep my eye on this and keep you guys posted as to any more information I do get. But I just wanted to keep you updated and in the loop um, because as mentioned, this privacy policy states that they can now collect information um, that's publicly available online um, from or from other public sources to basically help train their Google AI models like Translate, BARD, and Cloud AI capabilities. And if I do get any more information and you are using the Google products and services, I will obviously post and keep you updated accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.